Hi, this is Jason from the QuickBooks team. With the QuickBooks mobile app and QuickBooks Payments, you can use your phone to collect payments. When you use Tap to Pay, you can charge customers credit cards, debit cards, and digital wallets like Apple Pay without a separate card reader. Let's go over how to set up Tap to Pay and then how to use it to charge a customer's credit or debit card. When you open the QuickBooks mobile app, you may see a message about Tap to Pay. If you do, select Set it up. If you don't see this message, select Menu, Settings, Tap to Pay. From here you can enable Tap to Pay. Note you must be the primary admin to enable this feature. After the primary admin enables Tap to Pay, other users on your account can use it too, if they have the appropriate permissions. Confirm that you're linking your phone to the correct QuickBooks account. Select Continue. Before you can enable Tap to Pay, you must agree to the terms and conditions. Select Agree. To receive emails about the latest features and tips on Tap to Pay, select Get Updates. Next, the QuickBooks mobile app sets up your device to accept payments. This can take up to two minutes. Now your device is ready. Select Maybe Later to close the window, or if you need to collect a payment on an invoice right now, select Receive Payment on Invoice. To go back to this screen, select Sales, and select the open invoice a customer wants to pay. Select Receive Payment. You'll see the total dollar amount you're charging. Select Tap to Pay. Then tap the customer's card or phone to your phone. If your customer needs a receipt, choose to email or text them a receipt. If they don't need a receipt, select No Receipt. You'll receive the funds along with other customer payments later with your QuickBooks payments deposit. Now you're ready to use Tap to Pay on the QuickBooks mobile app.